Prostate cancer is incredibly common. Probably going to be diagnosed in about 300,000 men this year in the United States. Dr. Oliver Sarter, a medical oncologist at Mayo Clinic who is focused on prostate cancer, stresses the importance of screening for the disease with a prostate-specific antigen test, or PSA. I think the number one issue for being diagnosed with advanced prostate cancer is not getting a PSA. It's a blood test that's analyzed for prostate-specific antigen, a substance naturally produced by your prostate. If a high amount of PSA is found in your bloodstream, it could indicate prostate infection, inflammation, enlargement, or cancer. I think generally starting at age 50 is a very reasonable number to start getting a PSA. But if you are African American or have a significant family history of prostate cancer or to have a genetic alteration that might predispose to prostate cancer, then you should probably get one even earlier. If the PSA detects an abnormality, further tests such as an ultrasound, MRI, or a biopsy may be recommended to determine if you have prostate cancer. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Jason Howland.